It's supposed to be a moment What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it Hey man, it's Young Swan Swan Happy New Year First day of um 2020 Drop a like if you're excited for the new year. Drop a um, comment of your new year's resolution down below. I like to read your new year's resolution. I ain't got a resolution. I'm just going to be that guy. I got a lot of plan plans for 2K20 or 2020. But look, so I got y'all with a phenomenal build, okay? Still working on him, but he is able to play in the park. This build is probably the best 1v1 build without like cheese like little um center ball tactics so basically overall i know a lot of y'all y'all gonna be asking because th this is like one of the best builds in the game overall especially for twos 1v1s and even 3v3s on ball lock that can still dunk now look if y'all seen certain players they play on the 1v1 court this is like one of the best builds that they use and they, they can do everything, okay? You get contact dunks, contact driving layups. You can um, fade from the midi on some cheesy. You can shoot consistently greens with a 70 shot from three and midi. You just gotta have the right badge lineup. And with this build, see I, my two way pass for point, my two-way pass first point is kind of like this with different adjustments. If y'all want to see how to make my two-way pass first point, he's kind of like this, but um, he's not. He got a um, max wingspan. We're not talking about him. If you want to see him, go um check him out. But this build right here is going to be able to aggressive at any time, be the best on-ball lock, 99 speed, 99 acceleration. Once you get him, you know, to the 99 and stuff. Or, um, yeah, blah, blah, or not even the 99, the gym rat. And by the way, to get gym rat, all you got to do is play like 40-some games. Make sure you play your games on five-minute quarters. You feel me? Then uh, get like 40, 45 games, whatever. Send to the playoffs. Win the playoffs, you get your gym rat. So then you get plus four on all your physicals by the Gatorade, and then you'll get your double bar. And um, basically, like, this is like one of the best on-ball locks. And then I'll be able to aggressive. So I'm gonna be able to uh, duo ball handle when I'm not playing on my PG. Um, and like, that's very valuable because then my PG can dex behind a, um, a off ball screen and I could just kill the little PG that's guarding me in the corner. This is for like a comp lineup or whatever. But um, yeah, this is how I particularly did it. Gave him 11 finishing badges. Um, you, you want to have above a 85 so you get the crazy dunks or whatever. But, uh, yeah, so you need 10 badges. Um, the 20 playmaking, yes, sir. Um, let me see. Ooh, yeah, you, you can do that and then, you know, give it to, like, <laughs> like one of these. But, look, so a maxed out perimeter, defense, lateral quickness, steal, all stuff you need. Interior, you might want to um, boost that up if um, – you play ones and stuff, but I'm a 3v3 player. You feel me? So I don't really need that. I mean, I could, you know, because a lot of people be driving and stuff, but I didn't go for that. And instead of maxing out defense, I maxed out um, offense because when I'm on, bro, on offense, for instance, this is, I don't see why people don't upgrade offense. Like, look. Look, people be like, oh, you get more badges. No, you get one more badge. Like, shut up. Like, you guys swear. But, um, oh, shit. What the hell? I don't know what I just did. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I had it like five or whatever. I don't know. I don't know how I had it. But, um, say, for instance, my PG shoots the ball, right? I'm chilling in the corner, right? And, um, I can... I can crash down for a clutch rebound, right? Now on defense, the center's getting the board. I'm not crashing. I'm running the break, bro, most likely. You know, I'm not just going to crash and then they get a free break. I'm already running. So y'all build y'all's players weird. I don't I don't really get it, but I think offensive rebounding is way more important than defensive rebounding, you know? But hey, you know, to each his own. I'm going to show y'all my badge lineup too, so make sure... Y'all, uh, keep it, keep it together. But yeah, you know, we make them. Bro! 
Burly. You feel me? Burly gang down in the comments down below if uh, you made it this far. Make them burly. Now look, I made mine 6'6". Six, six, just for the glitchy height. You feel me? Now, the only thing is you're not going to be a, able to aggressive until later on when when you upgrade into like you know but if you got six five you're gonna be able to aggressive instantly so it's up to you you know if you're not gonna you know like grind this build out but i made them six six just to be glitchy still have a glitchy ball control and um i made them 180 because i'm gonna be a super fast lock you know and i want to uh guard ball and all this other stuff i don't i'm not even true sure what my physicals were to be honest Y'all could figure that out. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> but I made them 180, correct? And then I made the wingspan shortest as possible because I can run PG on this guy. I might even use this guy on the twos, the ones, and I just want a higher um, shooting and my midi gonna be, you know, once I'm, <laughs> bro, just think about it. Once you 99, your midi's in the 80s. You got no excuse to miss with that. And then, you know, you start getting the ball rolling and, you know, three point is hella easy to green. I'm telling you, with a with a low 70, it's hella easy. Now, you're going to have to, you need 86 ball control, so keep that in mind. So, I'm going to need 96, 97, 98 to unlock the 86, or I could have someone run floor general and do it. Very important, you know, you could dick the little guard that's guarding you and all that. It's just for the comp guys. Now look, no point of this, okay? Whatever, bro. It's like longer to get for this. Since you're like running breaks and stuff, you can unlock it. You know, it's up to you, bro. I personally pick this for my slasher, or you could even pick this. You know, um, <laughs> or this. If you want to break ankles and stuff, I have not made one person fall. Okay, so if you're interested in that type of content or whatever or you know um pick the playmaker but um i picked the slasher because i want to dunk on people and be very toxic and um the mistake i made with my last lock is i didn't put enough finishing badge on him he has a high driving dunk but this guy has an even higher driving dunk and he got the slashing badge so you feel me it's gonna be real toxic but um i'm gonna show y'all my badge set up for this guy you know we got the john jamar steve hans as well whatever i don't know exactly how i made this guy let me uh test this one. okay so for finishing Pro touch for the um toxic uh just boost for contact layups and stuff. It's not contact layups, but you just time it, you get an early release and uh, or a uh, um slightly late, slightly slightly, you get a boost to it as you can read. Slightly early, slightly late boost, so you know it helps you contest it, shh, you know. Um I could do back down punisher since you're gonna have the guard, but I'm not doing that. I got giant slayer. You know, you could have that on silver, or you could have slithery, drop step. It's all up to you. Giant Slayer, maybe it's for better dunks, or maybe it's the slithery. Hmm. Up to you. Y'all let me know y'all's experience down below. Or maybe the acrobat. Um, For the shooting badges. Now, it's different lineups for when you actually, like, play with him. Now, if you're on the threes, or you're in the corner... Corner specialist is far more valuable than catch and shoot. Clutch shooter is an amazing badge, by the way. But going to want to make your quick draw. It's up to you. Silver is good enough, but you can make it gold. I run it gold. I run range extender on gold. If I'm going to be running 1v1s and 2v2s, I'm going to run it on gold. But you don't need it on gold. Um, you need hot zone on like silver. This is personally my badge setup for when... um when like like i'm running on threes this is what i'm trying out right now 
But like if I'm like struggling to like shoot and whatever, and I'm gonna just be in the corner, silver, corner specialist is an amazing badge. A lot of y'all need corner specialists. Uh yeah, green machine only activates after three consecutive greens. And um, yeah, bro, uh catch a shoot, you could even throw that in there, or you could do this, you know. But currently I'm trying this out. And um, yeah, bro, like this is how I'm currently running it. Playmaking badges, 100% need these, 100% need these. You can't run the floor and dimer if your team bad. I got this like these. Um, You know, you could run something like this, but you could switch up your badges based off like what you're particularly playing. But I do something like this, you know, be like, hey, throw me to me on the break. And, you know, you get that boost and now him. Huh? threes you know I don't know now for the defense is probably what you bro the, the bro the bad setups is so toxic I don't even know why I'm showing this bro but um maybe it gives you some insight I run it on Hall of Fame I don't even know silver intimidator you don't really need uh more I'm not you know too convinced I'm telling you man intimidator is very overrated clamps probably one of the best badges in the game Tyler's defender is definitely needed on a lock. I don't think a lot of y'all know that. I run this on gold. Pickpocket Hall of Fame, game changer. I don't think a lot of y'all know that. Do not run pickpocket at all unless you are running it on Hall of Fame. Trust me, bro. Okay? Trust me. Um, Chase down bronze, you know, might have interceptor or might have lightning reflexes. Or take off, chase down, and double up on this. It all depends on what you want to do, man. You know, double up on this. You know, you might want to... Uh, uh. Now, a lot of people say, you know, you run it on bronze. You unlock different animations for the chase. You, know, you could do this. Um, you could test this. You could have this, this. All personally up to you, bro. Um, Yeah. This is enough badges, and this is the two-way Kawhi Leonard, Scottie Pippen, Michael Jordan build, man. I think this build, build is very good. Y'all rate it down below, down in the comment section. Y'all be sure to follow me on Twitter. Follow me on Twitch. Almost 100K followers on Twitch. Y'all help me reach that. Everything down in the description down below. Follow all my social medias. Make sure y'all go to the gym seven days a week. Drink a gallon of water a day. And um, let me know how you feel about this build. Let me know about your two-way, how you made your build. Let me know about your favorite build in the game. And um, I don't know. Adios. Y'all let me know what build y'all want me to test out. Blah, 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 blah. And um, yeah.